Hello there. Thank you for joining me today for Tiny Tales. Um, Tiny Tales is for children birth to 18 months and all the programs at the Orange County Library are based on Every Child Ready to Read, which are based on the ideas that you can read, write, sing, talk, and play with your child and build literacy skills. Whoa, you're saying, wait, this is babies. They don't write, they don't know how to write yet. No, they don't, but everything we do, a lot of the things that use their fingers, those are actually pre-writing skills. So um, sign language is a pre-writing skill and we're going to do our hello song now in sign language, okay? And it goes like this, hello, babies. You're gonna point to your watch for time you go from your chin out for say, and then hello, all right? And we'll do that all together. Here we go. Hello, babies. Hello, babies. Hello, babies. It's time to say hello. And remember that even if your child isn't doing it, they're watching you do it, okay? So they will eventually do it. All right, let's do that again. We do everything twice in Tiny Tales because they need that repetition. Hello, babies. Hello, babies. Hello, babies. It's time to say hello. Yay! So even though children don't understand the meanings of rhymes, it's important for them to hear them because by six months, they're already able to recognize language and the sounds of language, and rhymes just help introduce a different form of that, okay? So we're gonna do five little fingers. You're going to touch their fingers on their hands. Five little fingers on this hand, and five little fingers on that. A dear little nose, a mouth like a rose, two cheeks all rosy and fat, two eyes, two ears, and ten little toes. That's the way the baby grows. Yay! And you can just give them a big hug there. <laughs> Again! Five little fingers on this hand and five little fingers on that. A dear little nose, a mouth like a rose, Two cheeks, all rosy and fat. Two eyes, two ears, and ten little toes. That's the way the baby grows. Yay! Open, shut them. And this is also another one of those um, pre-writing skills because we're moving our fingers. Sorry, I have a hair in my eye. There we go. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, creep them. Creep them, creep them. Right up to your chinny chin chin. Open up your little mouth, but <gasps> do not put them in. <laughs> Yay! And this is another one. They're just going to watch you at first, but eventually they will start moving their fingers. Again. Open, shut them. Open. Open, shut them. Give a little clap, clap, clap. Open, shut them. Open, shut them. Put them in your lap, lap, lap. Creep them, creep them. Creep them, creep 
them right up to your chinny chin chin. Open up your little mouth, but do not put them in. Yay! Okay, now we're just going to rock them gently back and forth. And this is to the tune of a tisket, a tasket, but it's called I'm Growing. Okay? I'm growing, I'm growing, I'm growing up all over. I'm growing here, I'm growing there. I'm just growing everywhere. Yay! Again! I'm growing, I'm growing, I'm growing up all over. I'm growing here. I'm growing there. I'm just growing everywhere. Yay! Good job! Yay! So here's a fun fact. Sometime around the age of three months, children turn their head when they hear their name. And then sometimes around the, around the age of six months, they pay the most attention to the first word they hear after their name. So if you say something like, um, Kaylee, would you like to read a book? Well, the first word they're paying the most attention to is would, okay, which they will need to know eventually. But if you say, Kaylee, book, would you like to read a book? Book. Um, then they're paying the most attention to the word book. And you can do this with all sorts of things. You can do it with milk. You know, when you start feeding them solid food, you can do it with foods. Is they'll, they'll get to recognize those things quicker. Okay? So now we're going to make the attempt to put them on their backs. You want their head here and their legs here so that they are looking at you. And we're going to do diddle diddle dumpling. And you're going to bicycle their legs. OK? Diddle diddle dumpling. My son John went to bed with his trousers on. One shoe off and one shoe on. Diddle diddle dumpling. Bling, my son John. And then you can clap their feet. Yay! Again! Diddle diddle dumpling. My son John went to bed with his trousers on. One shoe off. And one shoe on, diddle diddle dumpling, my son John. Yay! Good job! Yay! So now we're going to do five little babies. Okay? And we're going to go ahead and leave them on the floor for this one. One little baby rocking in the tree. Two little babies splashing in the sea. Three little babies crawling on the floor. Four little babies banging on the door. Five little babies playing hide and seek. Keep your eyes tight closed now till I say peek. <laughs> Yay! And that's one another opportunity to do just sort of that little peekaboo with your baby. You can just have a scarf by your side and then gently put it over their eyes on the five little babies playing hide and seek and pull it off when you say peek. Yes! And we'll do it again. 
One little baby rocking in the tree. Two little babies splashing in the sea. Three little babies crawling on the floor. Four little babies banging on the door. Five little babies playing hide and seek. Keep your eyes tight closed now till I say peek. Yay! Yes, good job, baby. And then you can pick them up. And we're going to do Flying Man. Flying Man. Now this is the only lifting rhyme we will do today because it's a long one and we don't want you to get exhausted. <laughs> okay, here we go. Flying man, flying man, up in the sky. Where are you going to flying so high? Over the mountains and over the sea. Flying man, flying man, won't you take me? And a big hug there. Yay! You can never do too many hugs. Again. Flying man, flying man, up in the sky. Where are you going to, flying so high? Over the mountain and over the sea. Flying man, flying man, won't you take me? Yay! All right, now we're going to do our bouncy so we're going to put them in our lap and we're going to bounce up and down. Choo, 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 a train goes down this track. Choo, choo, chug a choo, choo, and then it goes right back. Choo, 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 a train goes down this track. Choo, choo, chug a choo, choo, and then it goes right back. Yay! Again! Choo, 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 a train goes down this track. Choo, choo, chug a choo, choo, and then it goes right back. Choo, 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 a train goes down this track. Choo, choo, chug a choo, choo, and then it goes right back. Yay! And of course, the smaller your child is, the gentler you might want to bounce. And as they get older, that sometimes they just like it really going. So you do what works well for your baby. All right, so now I have some book recommends for you um, because this is usually where we would do a book. Um, the first one is called Peekaboo Morning and it's by Rachel Isadora. She has a whole pile of wonderful books for babies. Peekaboo Morning, Peekaboo Bedtime, In the Beginning, oh, Babies, Friends, uh, tons of them, just tons of them. So they're great books. Um, Horns to Toes by Sandra Boynton. You also cannot go wrong with a Sandra Boynton board book, okay? And the library has numerous ones of those as well. They are great fun. Um, Baby Animals by Baby Animals at the Zoo. This is actually a um, nonfiction book, okay? And it's just all sorts of wonderful pictures of baby animals. And then Hello Baby by Mem Fox, which is just another book of wonderful things, but it has a, a really nice thing at the end, okay? <laughs> All right, it's time for Rockabye Baby, the kinder, gentler version. And you're just going to gently rock your baby. I'm actually going to sign this one, okay? So I'm gonna let Mr. Bear sit here and you can, and you can just rock your child. Rockabye Baby in Mommy's arms, tender and sweet, with all of your charms. 
I'll give you comfort. I'll give you love. Cause you are my baby sent from above. Yay! Again! I didn't want poor Mr. Bear to stall on his own. <laughs> Here we go. rock a -bye, baby in daddy's arms. Tender and sweet with all of your charms. I'll give you comfort. I'll give you love. Cause you are my baby sent from above. Yay! And last, but of course not least, is our Goodbye Baby song, which we also do in sign language. Here we go, same as hello, we just say goodbye. Here we go. Goodbye babies, goodbye babies, goodbye babies, it's time to say goodbye. Yay! Again! Goodbye, babies. Goodbye, babies. Goodbye, babies. It's time to say goodbye. Well, that was Tiny Tales. I hope you all enjoyed it, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to our YouTube channel to be the first to find out when we have new fun and informative videos for you. Orange County Library System is your place to learn, grow, connect.